Well, here I am at Project 83, as recommended by no less than Freddie Dobbs himself. Uh, there's a garage for motorcycle parking, and I'll flip around and show you that and some of the exterior, and then we'll go in so we can get a drink and maybe something to eat. So we've got a big old metric cruiser, I think. Or is it Harley? Metric Cruiser, Honda CB125, Triumph Speedmaster. Very nice, actually. Kind of liking them more. And an Indian Scout with all the all the doodars. Just walk outside, have a look round. Speedmaster and Guzzy just arrived. Now the sign says Project 83 Moto Gear Coffee Beer Ride and Jafai. Hmm. And there's Motorbike Lounge over there. And the one here. Let's go in and have explore. Let's see. Kawasaki GT 550 from back in the what, early 80s, late 70s. Harley Sportster and all that sort of stuff. And your food and drinks options. Let's go and have a look at the other side. Outside tables, beautiful day today. Don't know whether I've left the ignition in, doesn't really matter. Nobody's going to steal me bike from there. There's some people in here. Oh, here's the shop. There's some more coffee and stuff. So, we've got very nice looking gloves. A bit too fancy for me. More gloves, a little bit quiet. Oh, Merlin. Nice helmets. More coffee machine there. Uh, bike stuff, do I need anything? No. Let's just explore. So, we've got more apparel. Stuff for the women. Changing area. A much better range of trousers and stuff than you see in other parts. I might come back next time I'm wanting to upgrade my my gear. Some nice open face helmets up there. Waterproof trousers. That's what I needed last weekend. But I couldn't get them. Some nice boots. Yeah. Wonder if they have them my size though. Some back armour. Right. Lou next, and then some coffee. Out here, I'm going to say working on this area, big space. Plenty of room for either parking or possibly put a stage up here. Outside seating, obviously, maybe barbecues. Yeah. So what are you intending to do with this space? So there's going to be street food traders going along there. There's yeah. going to be a wild spa going in the corner with a sauna and also cold water therapy. And then along here, we've got a bit of a sort of seating area going yeah. in, landscaping, loads of plants. Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah. Cool. Fire pits. Yeah. Um, what else have we got? Yeah, so we're sort of decorating it at the moment, landscaping it all. A lot to be done. Yeah. And then on a Thursday, when it's bike night, this all just gets full of bikes. Right. So, so they ride through there, straight yeah. in, and we have a one-way system where they come through and then out this way. Right. So cool. yeah, I'm decorating it so we've got sort of chevrons pointing outwards. Yeah. A sort of bit of artwork on that gable end. Bit of artwork on this end here. Yeah, I like the industrial vibe. Yeah. Cool. Thank you. Yeah, we really wanted to keep it linked to the moto industry. Obviously, it's been a garage for so many years. Um, right. Yeah. We're getting there. Still a lot to do. We're putting in double glazing. Um, keeping the doors, we really want to keep the industrial aesthetic. Definitely, yeah. So um, yeah, the patina. Yeah, keep exactly. The patina. Yeah. yeah, absolutely. And then we've done moto uh, maintenance courses. Yeah. So we've got more of those scheduled. Um, we do little markets to support local businesses. Yeah. So, yeah, getting there. Marvelous. Keep, keeping me busy. <laughs> yeah, I'll be back, as, as somebody once said. Certainly, the great advantage uh, of this place, in many ways, is is that there is covered parking so you're not going to get come back to a wet seat so just a quick look at the general environment so there's the over the, the way bit it's in a sort of fairly downbeat area of nuclear which there are quite a few but uh, on the whole definitely a good addition to the motorbike world 
So that was a chat with one of the owners giving a, a rundown of, of what's going to happen here, and that sounds pretty amazing. Right, night is Thursday. Now, we'll definitely be back for that on a decent night. Yeah, I'm looking forward to that. Um, good to have another proper bike venue around Cornwall. So this would be me, Andy, Captain Clumsy, doing a quick visit and round up of what's happening at Project 83, and it's pretty exciting too for Cornwall. So thank you very much for watching, and please, please do like, comment and subscribe. It means a lot to me. The channel's growing fast at the moment, and uh, I really want to bring you along with me. So, see you in the next one.